Boomers, this is Paul here. Today's tutorial is going to be on the control panel. It's going to be short and sweet. The control panel is Windows window onto its own system. Here's the uh, default view of categories. It comes in with about uh, eight different categories. Style for security and ending in ease of access. There's lots of subtitles in these things. It looks rather busy and if we take security we can see on the left, security is highlighted, and there's the other items from the main panel. On the right, we've got this breakdown of um, subtitles here, and down to flash, and we can go back and uh, pick another one. There we go. And again, shows you the main categories on the left. On the right, a breakdown of the subtitles. Still looks rather busy. I tend to like. Uh, the large icons view myself. This shows me everything from A to Z. Um, that's the action center through to Windows Update. I kind of like that because it lists everything in between. So if you want to get hold of, say, the backup or the display. To get to the control panel on Windows 10, we have a similar layout with a start button down the left hand side. We can just go down there and click on it, and then we can scroll all the way down to the bottom of the list here, to the Windows System folder, and expand that, and a couple of items down in the list, there's the control panel. There's also the option to just type it in as a search parameter, so I start typing in the word control, and up it comes as I'm typing it, so I can go in that way. There you have it. These are all going to be covered in future videos, so please uh, do like, share and subscribe, and uh, we'll cover these off one by one.